Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a massive Ulta haul. I'm so excited you guys. So they had a 50% off sale going I believe last week and I just went ahead and splurged and bought myself a few things kind of as a birthday present but kind of just like a treat yourself moment. I did get some things for fall and I got some makeup items which I haven't really purchased makeup in a long time. So it made me really excited to get these things and I hope you guys are ready for the haul. Okay, I wasn't lying. I literally have so much stuff and I got a ton of freebies, you guys. Honestly, if there's one tip I could give about Ulta is to buy during your birthday month because you get five times points so you earn a lot of points that you can cash in for cash off. Um, and also look out for their events because sometimes they'll have like purchase however much from a certain brand and you can get a freebie from that brand. So that's what I ended up doing. I got two freebies from two brands for doing all that and I got five times points because I purchased during my birthday month, month which is August. So I will start with the first thing that I ordered that I actually need, which was like the only thing that I actually, well, I needed two things actually. And that was a moisturizer for my face. So I went ahead and bought from Bioma and this is their moisturizing gel cream. It has a triple ceramide complex with niacinamide and green tea. So one of you guys actually recommended them in the comments, I believe on my Instagram, I posted that I was looking for a new um, skincare recommendation and somebody said Bioma. So really happy that they have this at Ulta because it was really easy to pick it up. It is a deep hydrating, lightweight, oil-free gel cream moisturizer. So I do have combination skin, so I figured a gel-based moisturizer would probably be better for me. And I'll let you guys know how it goes because I'm really excited to use this. I'll probably put this in my uh, bathroom like right now. Okay, and the other thing that I actually needed was a facial scrub. So I started using the Fresh, um, I'll have to put the name of it down here because I can't remember the name, but it's a mask that you use in the shower or you can use it in the shower, you don't have to, but I do. And you scrub it on your skin, you leave it on and then you wash it off. Well, this one is supposed to be a dupe of it because the Fresh, the one from Fresh was like $35. And this one I think was 19 or 18. So this is the Skin Food Strawberry Sugar Food Mask. Comes in this beautiful packaging. I believe it is bigger than the, than the other one from Fresh because this is 4.2 ounces. It's so cute. It comes in like this little jelly jar. It's supposed to look like jelly. You guys, I love K-Beauty brands because they come up with the cutest packaging design. But this is what it looks like. It's beautiful. It's for pore cleansing and exfoliating with salicylic acid. And this is another one of those masks that you put on and you rub it in, you leave it on for a while and you wash it off. So you guys look at it, it looks so yummy, are you joking? So I'm excited to try this one, see if it is a dupe. Um, it definitely has a lot more fragrance than the fresh one, but I will test it out and keep you guys updated probably on my socials on like Instagram or TikTok. So keep an eye out on there. Okay, while we're on like a K-Beauty kick, I did get some things from Tony Moly. So I am about to run out of my eye patches. So I went ahead and picked up the Tony Moly Plumpkin Retinol Eye Patches. You guys, how could I resist this packaging for fall? Like, are you kidding me? They're so cute. So it says, plump up delicate skin under your eyes with this gentle blend of retinol and pumpkin extract. This soothing vitamin packed under eye mask will work to diminish fine lines, wrinkles, and dark circles. So that is this one. I'm really excited to try this one out. I've only ever really tried the Tony Moly face masks, so I'm excited to try some other products from them. Speaking of their face masks, I did pick up this Superfood Mask Bowl 6 mask set. I thought this was pretty smart of them because this was actually a really good deal. It comes with the I'm Cactus sheet mask, the I'm Honey sheet mask, I'm Coconut, green tea and aloe. So they all do something different and I really, really love these. If you can find them on sale, they're usually on sale every now and then at Ulta. I adore them and I always pick up a ton when I see them on sale. So I'm happy to have a new six pack. And then I believe it was like spend $30 on Tony Moly to get a free gift. So I did get this little gift. It's the I'm Coffee Gel to Cream Soothing Scrub Mask. This is actually the same concept as the other one. You um, rub it on to, I believe damp skin, is that right? After cleansing on towel dried skin, gently massage the gel mask in circular motions until a creamy texture forms. Once creamy, leave on for 10 to 15 minutes and wash off. So it is a little like face scrubbing mask and I'm excited to try this out. 
I don't think I've ever tried like a coffee skincare item. Oh my gosh, you can smell the coffee. Wow, that's great. Okay, so this is my little travel size version of the um, exfoliating face mask. So I'm excited to try that one out. And then you guys know, if you know me, you know that Tree Hut launched their fall product line. And of course I picked something up. So I did pick up the limited edition Apple Macchiato Shea Sugar Scrub. It did come in this packaging, which I thought was great. I did already open it and sniff it because it's me. Or who are we kidding here? Um, it took everything in me not to buy every single product from the line, but I've already tried the pumpkin spice one. I knew I loved it last year and I already tried the coffee one and I still have a backup to use this year. So I figured I would try the apple macchiato and I am planning on using um, champagne, apple and honey from Bath and Body Works in the fall. So I thought this would be a great compliment. It smells like apple gummies or like candy. It smells so good. It's this beautiful like red coral. It's so pretty. I'm so excited to use this, you guys. It smells so delicious. So that is apple macchiato. I would not say there's any coffee scent in this at all. It's like an apple gummy bear. So next I have a few items from ColourPop. They were 30% off, I believe on the whole entire brand. So I did pick up three items. I picked up the BFF Cream Gel Liner and then I picked up two shadow sticks. So I picked up the liner in a brown. This is Brouhaha. It's like a brown black color. I don't actually own a brown um, pencil eyeliner. I own a brown liquid and I love it. So I figured I'd get a brown pencil liner and try to start doing some more like smoky eyeliner with um, brown liner, but it, oh, the tip is a little bit dented, but that's okay. It does look, it's so creamy, you guys. It looks like my eyebrow hair color, so that's perfect. And I think this will be really, really, really nice in the fall to use with like some orange tone shadows or like some golds. Oh, it's gonna be so pretty. So I'm really excited to have a new little eyeliner. And then in the shadow sticks, I've never tried this formula before, so I'm pretty excited. I did pick up two. I picked up Honey BB and then Friday Feels, and they're both metallics. So we have Honey BB, which is more of like a champagne color. I figured this one would be good for like every day. I could stick it in my inner corner and it would be really pretty. So this is like a champagne metallic, very pretty. Oh, it glides on so well and so easily. So this is what it looks like. It is very similar to my skin tone, which is perfect. So I could kind of do a wash on my entire lid. Okay, I will say be careful because I can't put this back down even though I, I hope it doesn't hit the lid. I probably squeezed it up a little too far. And then I thought I'd be a little bit daring and do a like peachy color. So this is Friday Feels and I believe it was described as like a coral pink. It is also shimmery and I thought this would be really fun for like the close of summer to use this one. And I think it does have like a metallic shift. Yeah, it's like gold, gold coral shifting. Oh my gosh, you guys. This swatch does not do it justice. It is so pretty. I cannot wait to use this on my lid and do like a fun little eyeshadow look. Oh my gosh, you guys, this is gonna be so much fun. So that's a new one. I'm excited to play around with all this ColourPop stuff because I've really only tried their like complexion products. I've never tried any like eyeshadow kind of stuff, which is what they're known for. So I'm excited for that. You guys, this whole handful is all freebies. So we'll go through this last, but I do have a perfume and I know you guys are gonna be interested in this one. So this is Mod Vanilla from Ariana Grande. You guys know I had to get another vanilla perfume because who am I if I don't like vanilla? But don't talk to me about Ariana Grande's like current stuff in the news because I haven't caught up on it even though I like love her. I haven't caught up on it and I don't really want to. Anyways, for Mod Vanilla, it is supposed to be like a vanilla based perfume but I think it has some other stuff to it because it's a little more upscale I have to say. It has like the same back note of like Chanel Chance where it lasts pretty long. This smells amazing. This is intoxicating. I feel like this will also be really nice once it like pairs down and melts a little bit with your pH. I feel like it's gonna be really yummy after a few hours or even after you like sweat just a little bit. I don't know, I feel like perfumes are always a little better after that happens. But for now it smells really nice and like a very uh, playful vanilla. I would say that it's more like a spring vanilla than it is like a fall and winter, which is what I'm used to, like Kaoli Vanilla 28. 
That one is totally a fall and winter vanilla. I feel like this one is more like bright and airy versus like warm and gourmand. So yeah, I was planning on using this in the fall, but I mean, I still can, but it definitely is more of like a year round um, light and airy kind of vanilla. So, um, and then as my little birthday freebie, I got this Tarte Tartlet Mascara. This is a tubing mascara, so I'm excited to try that. I didn't really get to choose. I know at Sephora you get to choose your birthday gift, but at Ulta you don't. So this is like the only thing I could choose from. So that's what I got and it was free. So I'm not gonna complain. And then they were doing a deal. I think it was buy however much skincare, get a free La Roche-Posay mini set. So it comes with the cleanser, the Replump Hylou B5 Serum, the moisturizer, which is the double repair face moisturizer, and then the protection 50 SPF. This packaging is a little beat up, but that's okay. It comes wrapped in some tissue paper. And then here we are. So this is for, I believe this is all for normal to dry skin, which is good because like I said, I have combination skin, so I could really use any of it. But this is the Tolerane Hydrating Gentle Cleanser. I figured this would be perfect for traveling. This is their anti-aging Hylou B5 Serum with pure hyaluronic acid. The Tolerane Double Repair Face Moisturizer. And then I'm excited for the SPF so I can have a little travel SPF to bring with me. This is SPF 50. It's the Tinted Mineral Light Fluid Sunscreen. I did not know that it was tinted. That's going to be fun to try. So that's this little La Roche-Posay set. I always love when Ulta gives away these like little mini gift sets. And then I don't remember what the L'Occitane like promo was, but somehow I ended up with a free bag of L'Occitane. So I'm not going to be mad. It is this cute little floral pink bag. I think this is adorable. I'll probably use this to travel with and like put my hair ties and stuff in here. So I thought that was fun of them to include a little like reusable bag. And again, it comes wrapped in gift wrap and then oh, the inside of the bag is yellow. That's so cute. And then here we have four items from them. We have the shower oil, which this one is like a shower oil. It turns into a foam when you use it in the shower. I do actually already have this. I think this is like $15 on its own. So this is pretty awesome that you get this in a little mini set for free. So that's this one. I do already own it and I do like it. We have the Immortel Reset, Reset Nuit Serum. I believe this is a face serum. It's the Overnight Reset Oil and Serum. There we go. It looks really, really cool. It has these beads in there. I don't know if you can see them, but that's super fun. I did not know that they did skincare. I thought it was only body care. And then we have the dry skin hand cream. This is just shea butter, really nice and tiny to put in your bag. And the last thing is the supple skin oil, which I am excited to try. This little packaging is so cute. This looks like something you'd get in a hotel. It's so adorable. So that is a little L'Occitane set. I thought that was really awesome. I love getting a bunch of freebies from Ulta. I do this like once a year where I find all the freebies I can get and I just do however many purchases I need to get to it. So even though it's not the best purchasing decision, I only do it a few times a year, so it's like justified, but it's usually gonna be during their like the spring and the summer or at um, Black Friday. They usually have really good deals on Black Friday to get some free stuff. But anyways, that is everything for today's video. I hope you enjoyed this Ulta haul, kind of impromptu and fun and I just had a great time shopping online for some makeup that I really hadn't bought in quite some time so I had I still have the swatches on my hand I need to get these off of my hand but that is everything for today's video I hope you guys enjoyed let me know down below if you loved anything from this haul or if you have any recommendations for me let me know that too but thank you guys so so much for watching and I will see you all in my next video bye